Hi everyone. I don't even know if you can hear me with, with this mask on. So I'm going to take my mask off. I just showed this condo and it's really pretty. And I just thought I'd go live and show everybody. It's between South First and South Lamar. It's on a street called Brody Street. And it's a three bedroom condo. This is the outside. Let me walk back to the outside. I'm going to flip it around. That's the front. We have all these pretty trees, mature oak trees, little gate between you and your neighbor. You can walk out onto uh, South Fifth Street. Let's go inside. Little welcoming area. So to the right is going to be a combo dining sitting area. And then that patio door outside. Stairs. Walk through to the kitchen. Hi, Brenda. <laughs> so, a little cute archway into the kitchen. It's not the most modern kitchen, but it's pretty nice. It's got upgrades in 2014. Nice granite countertops. Kind of a nice big sink. And so good sized kitchen. I know it's hard to, from camera angle, but that's kind of looking right through again. I like these wooden blinds. Walking back through, got a little half bath. Let's go outside. Cute little sitting area. I'll show you the built-ins. Has nice built-in bookshelves, CD shelves, whatever you want to use it for, and a fireplace. Check out the floor. Really nice honey kind of colored flooring. And then we're going to go outside in this cute little courtyard, nice and private. Beautiful jasmine. Wish I had smell of it. It smells amazing. So you've got like this nice covered little area with a fan and you're on a corner so you have all this lush greenery but nice low maintenance no grass to mow and again a little gate that you can get outside great if you've got a little pet and even a kiddo so. Let me go upstairs. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. So, nice new carpet on the stairs. This was used as a rental for a few years, so it'd be a great rental property if anyone's looking for investment property. Top of the stairs, you've got a bathroom, bedroom one, bedroom two, master room. And this cute little, real great use of space. A little home office area. Again, with some built in storage. Into the master bedroom. Nice windows. Really standard closet. And for a condo, a really big bathroom. They like orange in this house. A lot of tangerine. Not quite UT burnt orange. There's me. And again, that really great use of space. If you don't need an office, kiddos can do their homework there. It's a little upstairs bathroom. And again, pretty decent sized bedrooms. I've taken the door off the closet here just to make it a bit more spacious. This is the view out of the kitchen. I'm sorry, out of the bathroom. So it's a very quiet, gated neighborhood. I forgot to mention it was gated. So it's a little bit of extra security, even though it's a pretty safe area. Another bedroom. And then 
the whole place is very light and sunny. Back downstairs. I'm going to get a close up of these wood blinds because they're really pretty. They have the little black straps which kind of make it kind of artsy. And then when they close, they're a nice honey brown that matches the floor. Hey Danica. <laughs> so I just showed a couple this from New York who are thinking of rent buying it as an investment home because they just got here and we're all masked and gloved up, being safe. Again, that's the view out the front door. Nice big old oak tree. So if you or anyone you know would like to view this, it's vacant. So all the furniture you saw was staged. The people have moved out. I'm only showing vacant homes right now for safety reasons. I didn't show the garage actually. This is the garage. Ooh. Nice big garage with storage and a washer dryer. Nice double garage. It is adorable, Danica. It's they're asking five hundred and forty-five thousand for it, which is actually very reasonable in this area. I'd be happy to show it for anyone watching. Feel free to share it on your social media. If you know anyone that wants to live close to downtown, but not right downtown. And like I said, it's three bedrooms, so it's great to have the office space, or if you just need a bit more space. Built in 2001. It's about 1,500 square feet. So message me if you want any more details. Thank you for those that watched. I slipped my mask off. I don't think I can speak with a mask on. They get so hot. You all have a great day and be safe out there. Bye.